Charleston, South Carolina. With a rich history, well-preserved architecture, and picturesque points, Charleston is the biggest city of Carolina and is known as the top travel destination in the world. Its history, entertainment, and art are all breathtaking. But did you know why 7.3 million tourists visit this heaven every year? Well, after watching this video, you'll get the answer. Today we will discuss some interesting facts about Charleston, including different things that you must know before visiting this city. So be sure to stick around until the end to find out what exciting things you can do there. Charleston has the darkest past, but its modern status as a vibrant cultural hub is more intriguing. This waterfront city has all kinds of entertainment from water activities to land surfing. This antebellum town's historic landmarks, museums, secret gardens, and overgrown alleyways surprise the visitors. Here, the temperature is a bit higher, but charming and beautiful people, streets, buildings, and mysterious gardens will not make you feel tired. Charleston is full of exciting activities, but first, let's give you an overview of the historical tourist-attracting city. In 1670, honoring King Charles II, a city named Charles's Town was built, but later it was named Charleston. Within 10 years, this city became the fifth most populated city in North America, having a population of 150,000. It is located in the middle of South Carolina's coast, where the Ashley River and the Cooper River meet to form the Atlantic Ocean. Travel and Leisure magazine has named this city the top-ranked U.S. city in travel. You can visit it from March to May or September to November as the temperature remains mild in these months. Charleston is famous for its historic sites. The people of this city are more welcoming, kind-hearted, and most importantly, have a low crime rate. So let's take you to some of the best recreational points in Charleston. First comes the Battery, a must-visit point, starting from Charleston Harbour and running along Charleston Peninsula. It is famous for southern-style mansions, historic antebellum homes, White Point Gardens and other historic points. From here, you get a spectacular view of Sullivan's Island, historic Fort Sumter and Castle Pinckney. Be sure to visit White Point Garden, tucked away under grand oak trees offering an amazing ocean view. Then comes Isle of Palms County Park, located just 16 miles east of the city. It's a 7 mile long shoreline that is a haven for water enthusiasts. It's famous for water sports, boating, kayaking, a golf course and restaurants. Here kids can do tubing while adults can go fishing, swimming and sailing. If you don't like the city's hustle and bustle, let's take you to Folly Beach, which is located 12 miles south of downtown Charleston. You can enjoy the charming southern sunset, surf, or head to the pier to sit and fish. Its sand is pretty clean and safe for your kids. To learn about the city's maritime history and get a better view of Charleston Harbour, consider going for a boat tour. You can rent a speedboat, kayaks, paddle boats, and cruise here. On a kayak tour, you can spot dolphins, feel the thrill of speedboat adventure, and board a sightseeing cruise to get a spectacular view of all the sights. And if you are with family, you can consider a luxurious dinner cruise to enjoy the best of this place. If you want to know about this city more deeply, take a walking tour across this living museum. There are centuries-old mansions, cobblestone streets, and many other unique streets. On the walking tour, you must explore King Street for shopping opportunities. Also, be sure to visit Old Exchange and Provost Dungeon, Old Slave Mart Museum, Pink House, French Huguenot Church, and other antique buildings. Also, be sure to visit America's oldest public garden, Magnolia Plantation and Garden, which has been open for visitors for the last 150 years. This 400-year-old plantation, sprawling over 464 acres, includes a zoo, a maze for kids, a cafe, and a theater where you can watch the interesting history of this garden. 
Other than this, you can visit Drayton Hall Plantation and walk under the oaks while enjoying the river view. It also holds the title of America's oldest unrestored plantation house and an example of Palladian architecture. What about exploring the stunning gardens at Middleton Place? Its evening view is more fascinating with landscaped gardens. If you get tired of walking, take a ride on old-fashioned horse-drawn carts. These carriage rides are available all day, taking you to 30 blocks of Charleston's tourist-friendly streets. This ride gets wonderful when the guide shares spine-tingling stories of the city. Several miles southwest from Charleston, there's Fort Sumter National Monument from where the first shot of the Civil War was fired. If you're a history buff, you must visit it to get more information about the role of this fort in the Civil War and explore stone caverns that still have Civil War cannons. If it's not enough, head towards Charleston Museum or National Russell House Museum to explore the history in detail. Those who love outdoor activities and want to get out of their comfort zone can go to Wild Blue Rope Adventure Park. There are outdoor adventure courses for people of all ages. Crossing tightrope is most famous. At the same time, hikers among you can go to Core Core Interpretive Center. Shem Creek Boardwalk is one of the best picturesque points where you must bring a camera with you. Stunning sunset dining near water and pure environment make it more lovely. There's another picturesque point located in Core Core Interpretive Center. It's an elevated boardwalk that passes across wetlands, swamps, marshes, and woodlands. In this 10 kilometers of area, you will find numerous local species of animals. With an empty tummy, you can visit all these points, right? Well, Charleston is famous for its food, which means you can enjoy some mouth-watering meals there. Be sure to visit the Hall's Chop House, which holds the title of the best restaurant in the city because of its prime steaks and fresh seafood. You can also try North Carolina's first craft brewery at Palmetto Brewery or tea-flavored vodka at Firefly Distillery. This distillery is the oldest in the city, and vodka lovers must stop here to try their famous vodka. Here in Charleston, your nights will be much more entertaining at Charleston Music Hall, where world-famous artists perform every night. Local musicians also perform at Fort Jazz Lounge. Other than this, there are numerous theaters hosting comedy shows that will swing your mood in seconds. The pressed ones among you must attend those shows. If you're a shopaholic, you'll find world antiquating and designer boutiques here in Charleston. You'll get each and everything from international brands to local products on King Street. Moreover, on each month's second Sunday, King Street is blocked from traffic, so visitors can enjoy live music, dining, and shopping galore. But you can't visit all these recreational spots in a single day. So let's talk about the best rental properties in Charleston that will be suitable for you. Here are our top three recommendations. This beautiful one-bedroom, two-bathroom cottage in the middle of Charleston is the best that you can rent. It's the most suitable villa for couples or small families and is located in the Cannonsboro Elliott Borough neighborhood, the gateway to the peninsula. There's a beautiful garden and heated pool in it, and King Street is just one block away from you. It lies in the heart of Charleston, as Morris Island Lighthouse is 5 minutes walk away and Hall's Chop House is 400 feet. Next we have this 3,920 square feet 4 bedroom and 5 bathroom rental house, located in the historic Broad Street. This rental house is ideal for a large family as it includes everything that a family needs from large space to outdoor cooking and a wide pool. The second story of this rental house has something really impressive. Here you'll live like a local as it gives access to top shopping and dining spots along King Street. Also, you can enjoy elegant views of Colonial Lake nearby. Lastly, we have this top-rated three-bedroom, two-bathroom house located a few steps away from King Street. VRBO labeled it top-rated because of the manager's kind behavior and 
excellent service. It has air conditioner, laundry, smart TV and many other amenities making your stay more comfortable. If you want to make your trip an unforgettable one, then be sure to rent one of these free houses. Charleston is an all-in-one recreational destination having a welcoming attitude and countless crazy stories. People fall in love with its overall charm as it is the perfect place to stay. This city is full of natural beauty and has tons of places that you will love to visit. So if you want a break from your busy life, Charleston could be one of the best destinations to have peace of mind. Do let us know in the comments if you have ever been to Charleston in South Carolina. And be sure to check out our video about Haco in Costa Rica.